Testing one, two, and three. Yeah. Something from the brain of Steve Saylor. Ode to Jumbo Video. I got out of my parents' Oldsmobile Cutlass Supreme, holding the gift certificate to Jumbo Video tightly in my hands. I won it the night before at a St. Catharines Falcons hockey game. It was the first time I won anything, and I was excited. I walked into the store with my family, and it was a giant video store. And I loved this place as a kid. For those who know me now, you know how much I love Starbucks. To me as a kid, Jumbo Video was that store. It was my Starbucks, you know, mine's the coffee. As an example, when you walk into the store, there's a giant popcorn machine that you can get bags of popcorn for free. Oh, I can taste and smell the, uh, the salty, buttery, good, Hold on. So the store took the majority of the size of a strip mall, and as I browsed through the as I browsed through the aisles of video games that are waiting to be purchased, they had everything from NES to Sega Genesis. Sadly though, my $15 gift certificate would not allow me hours of gaming glory. And yes, even back then, video games still cost about 40 to 50 bucks. So I asked my mom what to do, and she suggested go to the previously viewed VHS aisle. Yes, this is even before DVDs were a glint in anyone's eye. So I walked through the aisles and aisles of previously viewed VHSs. I couldn't decide on what to get. And then, I saw it. Home Alone 2. Yeah. I picked it up, I showed it to my mom, she approved it, I bought it, I watched it, I loved it! Jump to 20 years later, I walk into that same Jumbo Video store for the first time in almost 10 years. Only to find that that Jumbo Video was going to be closing for good. Part of my childhood closed with it. I know that story was a bit of a downer, but if you want to be able to hear a little bit more of a part two or kind of a, a bit of a happier story ending, click on anywhere on the screen where the annotation is to be able to click to go to part two. Um, if you want to be able to read more of these stories, I have over a hundred of them in my ebook called Two Minute Stories. You can be able to, hold on, I got popcorn in there too, sorry. You can be able to download them in the description, in the link in the description below to the Amazon Kindle. You can be able to get it on your Kindle app for your Mac, your PC, your iPhone, your Android, or any other ebook reader if you so choose. Uh, again, link in the description, Amazon Kindle, Two Minute Stories. If you want to be able to hear me read more stories for you, or perform more stories for you, click anywhere on the screen for an annotation to be able to go to the playlist for all the stories from the Two Minute Stories book. Anyway, that's it for me. I'm Steve Saylor. As always, I remain obediently yours. Bye!